So thank goodness that one's really close to the island. They're always close to the island, though, these TCTs are. So, no freezing over there. Alright. And they don't call this place Bomb Island for nothing. You can actually come here rather early. As I, I mean, I did on my practice file. I came here really early. But I don't remember if I was able to do everything or not. Oh, jeez. Huh. We have a vendor here. The interesting thing about these vendors is you can actually blow them with the gore or with the leaf, and they turn out to be Gorons. <laughs> we'll see it again. Oh my God, they look just like they do in Ocarina of Time too. Anyway, that's hilarious. Anyway, those merchants will be involved in a side quest we'll be doing later. It's actually the town flower side quest. So that thing I was about to do with the flowers and the town, I should I guess I should get back to that because whatever. Well, because, because if I help his business, it helps the poor girl, so there you go. Jeez. How many times do I weigh the odds over whether or not to say something? It's dude, just say it. Fucking A, man. Oh, man, we got a big one over here. We got a live one. Just keep hitting the grass up for more supplies as we use ours up here. Now, that hole looks very interesting, but I'm not interested right now. I want to go down here and see what's on the tip. Man, this this episode is crawling with that's what she said jokes. Seriously. Okay. Oh, dude. Okay. That's interesting. Well, I bet I could just leaf around you, but I don't think it's worth it. All I see is pots out there. Anyway, I might do that later, just out of curiosity, because I am pretty curious. But. What's the best thing you could find under a pot besides maybe a 50 rupee or something? Mm. Hey, Goron, what's up, man? <coughs> so down the hole we go, which we should have done in the first place, but, yeah, sorry. And what's down here? I forget. Oh, cool. It's a cave with a switch. And the switch opens a door. So I'm guessing this is another one of those caves. Oh, we got these guys. But there doesn't seem to be any... Oh, of course, I should have known. Let's go ahead and use you. Out of my way. I'm using your brother for something, so if you don't mind. So I should have known better the moment I saw those. But, oh, well. Oh, this room. Yeah, okay. So you go over here and there's a switch over here. I guess you probably have to... Hmm. I'm guessing these come back too, don't they? Well, maybe not. Whoa! Uh, oh, okay, you gotta start over if you fall in the lava? Well, fuck that. Holy crap. Oh, but the fire's still gone. Hell yeah out of that. No! Dude! Okay, slow down next time. Seriously, you're going to run out of time here. Alright. Here we go. I see a couple of bitches here. I'm guessing I shouldn't kill them because it's probably... I see some holes over there. Let's try throwing this over there. Jeez. That didn't seem to do much. No, don't knock it back in the lava. Oh, I see a switch in there. Now we gotta wait for them to respawn, which may take a while. Oh, there's one right there. Get over here. No, you know, actually, I'll get on the other side of you. So, let me try that today. Yeah. Just don't want to throw them too far either, so. There we go. Hole in one, baby. Well, that. Ugh, a lot of good that did. Jeez. That just erased the fire around the switch. Let's try to get this one in the first hole over here. No, he keeps bouncing into that second one. Well, okay, I guess that works too. I don't, I'm not sure if I did that right or not, but uh, I'm taking my time because I don't want to fall in again. <laughs> Pretty sure this is a hard piece, but don't quote me on it. We'll find out in a second here. Yes, it's another piece of heart. We're just racking them up. That's right. More containers equals more life. Let's take a shortcut. <laughs> I'm guessing that's all that's here. So I'm gonna head back out of those pots and see if I can figure out what's up with those. 
I mean, how hard could this be? You just go, like, right here and then just kind of come swing around that way. And then, uh, yeah, rupee, rupee, rupee. Ten rupees. Okay, whoop de doo that's what I thought. What's going on in this raft over here? I always thought these rafts were kind of cool. Like, I mean, somebody built these, so why are they just sitting here? Well, maybe that raft belongs to the Goron merchant. Yeah, there we go. That's probably it, since they tend to not like water. Or so I hear. Wait, here, let's go ahead and open the ghost ship chart while we're here. Seriously? This is what it looks like. Okay, it shows all the different moon phases, and which island the ghost ship will appear at on those phases. And that's pretty much it. So, and you see Ahmed Bomb Island, I said it was a half moon phase when it shows up there. And sure enough. And uh, the other thing, the uh, treasure chart. I don't have 39. There's 41. That must be 4, I Reeve. Okay. So, uh... Oops. I replaced my sail. <laughs> so goodbye to Bomb Island. Oh, that was... That was easier than I thought. Ooh. Hmm. <laughs> oh, we do have a TCT here. Alright, guys. So, uh, I found a TCT. It's next to one of the Triangle Islands where we had to take the pearls at the beginning of the game. And this one is staying lit for quite a while. Like, like it almost wants me to find it. I think it's right up there against the island, too. There we go. Should have it. Nope. No. Oh. What? There we go. Knew he could do it. So let's pull that treasure up. Whew, that one's pretty deep down there. Deep down, as in the first episode of Angel, Season 4. How do I know that? I have no idea. Because I remember being totally taken in by that Season 3 cliffhanger, and thinking about it all the way to my sister's house to get the Season 4 DVDs from her, to borrow them. Okay, I, th I believe there was one person, at least, that wanted to see this. Uh, I don't remember who it was, because it was so long ago since I got the message about it. But, but you can actually come back to these islands and see what the goddesses actually look like. Because you don't really get a good look at them from, you know, from the angles that you see um, when you put the pearls in them. And it just shows like if for half a second it shows them. So that's that one, which I guess is Furore, since she's green and all. Of course, if she's green, that might mean she's Rydia, but never mind. That was so stupid. Anyway, whoa, 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 hey, you guys again. I'm guessing you only have to talk to these guys once, though. I'm sure they don't all have something to say. Yeah. You collect the treasure? I know you're probably sick of hearing this, but first you should open your sea chart and square the treasure the treasure house. Oh, you're giving me the rubies you found? Cool. Triumph Forks. Everybody thinks it's Triumph Forks, boy, I tell you. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, I thought you were going to give me some rubies. Okay, never mind. Well, move along, shall we? Next is Fire Mountain, which, as I recall, there's really nothing there either. Except for maybe a platform. I didn't miss a platform just now, did I? Because I know they're out there, and I don't want to... Yeah, there is a platform here. Let's see if we can find it. Well, I don't know what to say. We're sailing to a platform next to Fire Mountain, and it's uh, it's currently 5.23 in the morning here, where I'm at, here in uh, Nina, Wisconsin. There's two rolls of toilet paper on that platform. Look at that. It does look like toilet paper. Oh my god. That is amazing. See? I tell you, man. No, oh, keep going. No, 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 no. Just stay right there. Stay right there. Good lord. Ugh. What was that, man? See, that's, that's like 10 seconds right there that I should cut out. Uh, yeah. Where I passed the platform, basically didn't say anything as I turned around and went back, but... Oh well. Too late to turn back now. Man. Some days that ladder is just really long, you know. It's like some days you're the bug and some days you're the windshield. Oh, hi. Oh, you're all by yourself out here? Well, that sucks. Did they pay you enough for this? To work alone on one of these? Man, to die on the edge, that must be the way to go. Well, what do we got? Oh, he wasn't guarding much. Just 10 rupees. Yeah. Yeah. And pretty much sums it up. You get half of that just from these. Well, a fifth of that. <laughs> a fifth of that. Yeah. 
Were there cannons on this? I could have. Yeah, I know there are. I know there were. I am. I was. I will. Oops. Let's see, just in case there's another thing here. Show enough is, there is another treasure chest here. You almost had me there. You almost had my ass. There's actually one treasure chest I missed on a platform that's right about to the east of us now, and it has one of these in it, a gold feather. So, I'm not too worried about it, but it was one of those platforms I had to bomb all the cannons and I didn't get all of them. And so I missed a gold feather, but oh well. Oops. Okay, you know what, there, there is actually something I think I need to do at, uh, at Dragon Roost. A couple things, actually. 